joined in that parade that went from the streets, middle streets of Brockhampton, floats, bands, regalia, everything. They had their procession in their beautiful opera costumes with the feathers coming out the side. I've seen the pictures, they were just amazing. They were all on horses, no cars. Um, they had their, their pulled by horses, this lovely big wagon. And they, the big party in the showgrounds. And when they got to the showgrounds gate, just the Chinese were denied entry. Oh, yeah. The officials of the canton and the people of the canton said, no, don't watch it. Good enough to take part in the parade, but not good enough to join in the party yeah, with the Federation of Australia. So I'm surprised that, you know, that one of these people still keep, you know, a sense of humour about the whole thing. Yeah, off they um, We have unearthed uh, these Qing Dynasty, and I've had them verified by two sources. Uh, one was the uh, Lee McKinnon, who came up from the Bendigo Museum. Um, and uh, the Golden Dragon Museum in Mendigo and was excited to see them. And the second was David Rosier, <laughs> who came to an ADFAS lecture and I went to an Toowoomba and I said, look, I've got these pictures of this, would you mind giving, because he was all about. So, this is a dragon banner. This particular fellow woman is the um, dragon of the Qing dynasty, the emperor, empress, the last empress, the dowager empress, uh, was um, uh, that was her military uh, symbol. It's done. I don't know how many of you are familiar with uh, embroidery and guild work, gold work. But there's a lot of gilding in that. I mean, gold work in that. So that was done. All the scales, the clouds. It's been appliqued on, and. This would have been part, I suspect, of the parade. It's Qing Dynasty, it's got to be in that parade that went down to the showgrounds and got refused entry. I think it's just incredible that we have this. We have so little remaining from those times. We have the Joss, we have this. I think this brilliant that we have this. This is a um, gong banner. So this one's got in the parade as well. It's been hand painted, and I think failing to get something from China, they've done a pretty good facsimile here with paint. And I can't clean it, I can't do anything with it. It's a dragon. They're not servants, they're all dragons. I fancy them still being so bright over a hundred years later. I mean, amazing when you think about it. Just beautiful.